And to help Liz is royal fashion expert James Sherwood, a man who wouldn't be seen dead in jeans and a T-shirt. Now, James, if I'm popping out to the country, what are the golden rules outfit-wise? Nothing too bright, absolutely nothing too tarty, and definitely nothing too new. So how does Kate look sexy in a country look? I don't get it. Kate gives it a bit of Jilly Cooper. You know, yeah. she might wear a tweed skirt, but it's going to be a little bit north of the knee. Is there actual designers for this kind of wear? Well, there's certainly one over my shoulder now, the Hunter. The Hunter Welly has been an icon of sort of country pursuits. But the London kids who come to the country, people like Kate Middleton, you'd see her in a chameau. But it's nice to see that Kate Middleton's kicking off trends. You Le know, and, and they copy her. Really? Yeah, yeah, they copy her. So what other designers are, are we looking for? Well, you can't go wrong with Barber. I'm gonna oh, even I know about Barber. Exactly. The trick is you don't want it to look too new, to look too shop-bought. So you literally throw it in the bottom of a Labrador's basket and leave it there for a couple of weeks. I mean, this, this looks great. I would actually wear this. But is this expensive? It's north of £100, but not far north. It's not cheap, though. It's not cheap, but you can get them on the high street. What about tweed? I don't use hate a lot, but I hate tweed. I think there's a particular prejudice about tweed that's not quite correct anymore. The high street has suddenly got quite hip to, to tweeds. You know, Harris tweeds come back in fashion in a big way. So, James, what about hats? I mean, because there are a lot of different hats here. I like this. Can I wear this one to go hunting in? You wear it to go fishing. It makes you look a bit simple. The flat cap's always fantastic and usually suits everybody. You'd rake it at an angle and just down over one eye. Hi, Will. So where do we go for hair and makeup then? We don't, I'm afraid. I mean, it's minimal makeup in the countryside and we wear a hat. Um, I am not a happy bunny. Are you seriously telling me that I cannot have a bit of hair and makeup just to go to the country? You can have natural makeup. Oh. I love a cream blush because they look really natural and you just put it on very lightly around your lower cheeks, not on the apples up here so you don't have that doll effect. I like it. Thank you very much, Silver. What about hair, Mark? We're going to use no product and we're just going to... No product whatsoever. Like, just sorry, I'm grabbing a palette. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think you'd see Kate wearing a low ponytail. You know, mm. it's sophisticated, but it's 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 effortless and it's uh, it's very quick. Go on then. Right. Brush the hair really naturally. It's important that it doesn't look pulled back too tight. We just take a little bit of hair from underneath. We're just going to hide the band there. There we are. We're all ready for Balmoral now. Okay, I don't know how much I'm feeling the country look so far, but you know what? Just bring on the tweed. Could I blend into a royal shoot? It's time to change into my country outfit and find out if my makeover hits the target. Ooh, look at you. What do you think? I think great. you passed the test. I, I feel really great in this. You really do. I know I haven't seen it, but I feel really good. I mean, is this very Kate middleton -esque? Well, the, the point being you're wearing everything that Kate Middleton wears. I mean, the skirt's a tiny bit short probably for her. <laughs> The boots are the key piece in the whole outfit because they're Kate Middleton's favourite. They're Penelope Chilvers, and everybody wears them. It's sort of Kate Blanchett, you know, and Elle McPherson. She's on top of the trend, and I think they would hook a prince with legs like that, darling. Woohoo! Thank you! So, you ready for that mirror moment? I am. I'm really excited okay. to see, actually. Shall we? Mm. <laughs> oh, wow. Quite like my makeup. I bet you didn't think I was going to say that, did you? No, I didn't. <laughs> and I like my hair in a low pony. I haven't had it like this for years. I really do love you the You do coat. need your collar up. That's one thing. Ah. That's a dead giveaway if you don't have a collar up. I like it. I really do like it. Well, thanks for my makeover and everything, but um, I'm off to the country and you can sweat in the city. Suckers. Charming. <laughs>